Hey guys, it's Lizzie and I'm back and don't mind the mess in the room and I'll be doing stuff very fast and I'll be uploading, I don't know, probably three videos or two videos, depends on how, how much I can video today. Because I'm in a rush, I came to Turkey as you can see, different change in the room, I'm back in Turkey. And then the problem right now is I'm going to the beach side really soon. So yeah, um... So yeah, I'm, I'm going on a plane journey tomorrow, so hopefully that will be good. And today, I'll be reviewing... Again, I'm in Turkey and I'm reviewing crisps. <laughs> okay, so one sec, I want to check if this could be brighter. Yes, it could. It looks really dark here, doesn't it? Maybe I should just put this here like this and I should review like this yes sorry guys I just moved the camera in the middle this is better right we can see brightness hey I'm in a very musical mood today for some reason okay so there is a brand in Turkey called lace um I, I think it's a, it's a brand in other countries as well, but you can't, you don't usually find this in England, so yes. Uh, but you can find it in like those small Turkish shops that I, but you don't find as many flavors as you would in Turkey. So this fırından means from the oven. Um, kurutulmuş domates ve yeşillik taneleri. Um, dried tomatoes and small green pieces that's what it means but it means herbs basically okay this flavor this is such a weird flavor like even in turkey like they they are going some places soon you know like it's called tulum peynir ve zeytin aromalı last year i tried tulum peynir which is um a, a special type of cheese in turkey and they made a crisp for that this time it's cheese with olive flavored i'm really interested in how this is really going to taste like Let's open it up and smell it. Oh my god, it smells so good. Like, or maybe I'm hungry, I don't know. <laughs> but like... I don't know what this smells like. It smells something so familiar to me, but I just don't know. I can't put my finger on it. Is that what it is? Okay. These are slightly broken. When I got this, all the purple packages were slightly like damaged inside, so most of them are broken. But the other package I got is probably not like it was. It was in a better condition. It's a weird taste. It's slightly sour as well and very salty. Oh. See, the, basically, the first time I put it in my mouth, I like the taste you first get, but then I don't like the initial taste, like the aftertaste you get. You basically taste the olives. I'm in, I'm in love with olives. I eat olives so much. But then at the end, you get like a really cheesy taste, and I'm just like, Ugh, I don't know if that's for me. Let's try a bit more. This is nice. I mean, not too bad, but it's not what I expected. Because I love olives, I'd rather just fill and taste olives. I don't think cheese and olives went too well. Even though my whole breakfast, every morning, I'd have cheese and olives. Maybe if it was a different type of cheese. Anyways, today, I give this product a 7 out of 10. I mean, I liked it, but not too much. I want to see if the other one's going to be better. Okay, guys. If you already haven't subscribed to my channel, please do. I do. I'm gonna be doing more videos on like let's get tries it. I taste stuff. I try stuff on my face. I try stuff on my hair. I sometimes do vlogs very rarely. That's it from me today, guys. Bye. <laughs>